today we're going to just be doing a quick little grooming video for Percy um obviously Charlie is very sweet but that's beside the point but he um already got groomed a few days ago and I did like a little bit of trimming of his fur because it's summertime but now it's Percy's turn and he's back there just chilling um but this is what I have prepared to do it to groom him, I think. Um, just nail clippers. For the nails, a uh, like sharper brush, and then this softer one, and then another pair of nail clippers. But these ones got like super stuck, and they're not as nice, and they just like. It's not focusing, but they just, they never were, work, they never worked as well as my other stuff. Um, and then I just have a little towel. So this is, um, what we're going to be doing today. And then I'm going to grab my scissors. I usually don't comb his hair, but his little rose leg is getting pretty long. Like, yeah, oh, oh actually trim anything today but you never know um i'm just getting the little this is like my first aid kit that isn't my first aid kit it's i have like a little first aid kit but it's not like this this is my grooming thingy um so i'm just gonna grab him the hammock. So I'm just going to grab him. Hold on, bud. Okay, I got him. Okay, so let's just go back over here. Okay. He's just in my arms right now. Okay. where I like do all the health checks and stuff but I just have this on me because he'll pee and stuff but <laughs> um here's Percy he loves getting pet um he has an eye loop issue okay Charlie. Okay, I'm just checking his nails. Yeah, his nails need to be trimmed. So, I think that we got these just from PetSmart. Um, I don't know what brand they are. Stop. So, Percy does bite me. So, I'll have to do this so that he just doesn't bite me. Trimming their nails is, like, the hardest part of being a guinea pig or... Do you see? He's just like licking me. Why are you doing this? I know it's around your lunch time, but okay. Wait, let me just. This foot isn't actually too bad. Okay, the back feet always have longer nails than the front. And if your guinea pig like always bleeds when you are done cutting their nails, like all my nails, I recommend cutting at an angle instead. And cut instead of cutting just like straight down because that way it doesn't hit the skin. And you can use like that septic powder, or I don't know what it's called how to pronounce it but you use it for dogs when you trim their nails but it works
works with them too to just stop bleeding. Hi buddy, I know. He hates getting his nails trimmed. Charlie isn't as kind. He isn't Charlie isn't as um upset by it or he doesn't get as upset. Mm, we're almost done there, buddy. It's really important for them to have short nails. Um but the nails are done. So okay, I'm just he always gets like okay. So let me just hi buddy. I'm just brushing it off here because it always gets matted and crazy. Okay. Hi, buddy. Oh, and then these two brushes and this. The white nail clippers that I don't that I said I didn't like as much. They came on a set. Hi. Oh. Together they came in a set. I'm just realizing that this rose is like in me it's not very well. He looks so he looks so angry. Yeah. He likes being brushed, but not the nail trimming part, huh? And he's really shedding right now, so. Because it's summertime. Do, do, do. Okay. I think. He has a little bit of an attitude. If you couldn't tell. But now he's all shiny. He has a nice shiny coat now. So let's just go put him back. Ugh. Come on, buddy. Going back over the cage. Okay. You can see Charlie's butt hanging out of the hammock. Woo! And, yeah, tomorrow is cage cleaning day. Yeah, look at that. Charlie's just right there, and then... Here she's back there. Um, but I think that that's all for today's video. So, um, <laughs> thanks for watching.